I don't normally like to talk about controversial topics, but I really want to know what other people's opinions are on this. We all know that ag succession and transition planning is a really serious issue that faces our industry. The average age of the American farmer right now is something like 65 plus years old. And most people who are on multi-generational operations are not getting able to take on the operation or a big portion of the operation until they are in their late 40s, 50s, sometimes even older. So they are farming alongside their parents um, well into their 30s and 40s. This means that they are not allowed to make much decisions in most cases about how the business is run. That's not the true in every case, I don't think, but in a lot of them it is. Um, and it also means that they are not able to really affect the profitability of their farm or ranch until that later point in their life. And I think what this does is it sets us up as farmers and ranchers to be stuck in a cycle of very meager living. Um, because we aren't starting, truly starting, or getting to take a serious role in our businesses until we are 45, 50 years old. And that's just so late in the game um, compared to what every other business on the planet does for when you start building capital in your business. And I mean, at that point, you're already thinking about bringing your kids into the operation and you haven't even gotten to really come into your own in the operation yet. So your kids are living their lives if they return um, to the farmer ranch based off of grandpa's decisions still. And I just don't think that sets us up for a cycle of prosperity. It's putting the owner, the next owner, the next generation too far behind in the game at that point in their life. And I know there's some operations out there who are getting this farm succession thing right. So I would love to know what you've seen work well or what's worked well on your farm or ranch. We are not in a position where we are able to join a family operation. So my husband and I are trying to start from scratch, but I think that everybody who is in this kind of next generation trying to get into agriculture is just feeling really discouraged because either one, they have to start from scratch or two, they have to wait until they're 50 years old to even have much of a say in the business. and. I think that our food and our production agriculture industry literally depends on it.